Our project today is using varied vases and the coordinating punch. This is a brand new stamp set and coordinating punch which is available in the annual catalogue which starts on the 1st of June. It's a lovely stamp set with many vases and beautiful flower images that can be used in a variety of ways. For this first project, I'm cho choosing something fairly simple. So we're going to use the outline of the vase on a piece of Whisper White cardstock and inking it up in black. And the inside of the flower, we're going to use mint macaron which is a returning new colour and comes in our lovely new ink pads which open like a compact and slide simply across. Now, excusing my head, because I needed to line this up, you can stamp the detailed image inside the outline, which gives perfect two-step stamping. And then we're just going to punch the image out. Photopolymer stamps are ideal for two-step stamping because you can see exactly what you're doing. So now we're going to choose the flowers. There's a lovely variety of flowers in this stamp set. And I chose a pretty little daisy flower and another little flower which looked a little like heather. So with a piece of Whisper White cardstock and using the vase to line up where we want the flowers to be stamped, We're going to take a sentiment first and stamp the sentiment on the bottom. This set again has a lovely variety of different sentiments, so there's something for virtually every occasion. So we stamp the flower just slightly off centre. And the second flower we're going to stamp slightly off center to the right. These are beautiful detailed little stamps which fit perfectly with the bars. This also is a two-step stamp however you can color it in in a variety of other ways. And for this one, I've chosen to use our watercolour pencils. I just pop the sentiment down at the bottom. and then took our watercolour pencils and I chose Melon Mambo and Rich Razzlebury 
Pacific Point and Pool Party, and some Daffodil Delight to add a little yellow. Our watercolour pencils you can use with water or you can use as they are. And I wanted quite a subtle effect for this. So I chose not to add the water and use them just as colouring pencils. Now with a mint macaron mat and the little vase stamped in the mint macaron which coordinates perfectly. I'd put this up on some dimensionals and you have a lovely simple card. You can also do many other designs. This was one using the same two flowers and I just stamped them along the bottom which again is beautiful and for something really bright I did the vases in bright colours and using the labeler alphabet put happy birthday along the front. So you can see you can do this in various different ideas and designs. All the details as always are in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching me today and look forward to seeing you again soon. Bye bye.